Hey Hector, this is Adam over at Perkins Motorplex, man, getting you that video on the 2020 GMC Sierra. This is the 2500 diesel Duramax AT4. This thing is nice, <laughs> nice, nice. I've walked around it. I'm going to try to present it to you as clear as I can. Anything I've noticed cosmetically, I will point out, but this one here is really, really clean. So diving right in, it does qualify, just so you know, uh, for a factory type warranty protection. That's a wrap coverage, so all your tech, all your electronics, all of your four-wheel drive, uh, engine, transmission, AC, all the stuff that makes it nice and makes it go is fully protected with no deductible. That's nationwide coverage. Any shop or dealership of your choosing even protects the diesel turbo. Tires on this one here, uh, not uh, probably not brand new, but uh, lots and lots of tread. Honestly, still on those. Those are Coopers. Really good looking tires. Coming down the side, trying to use what little bit of sunlight I've got. Try to highlight any door dings, anything like that. I'm not noticing any of that. Does have the trailering mirrors. I have those extended, but they do go in and then also fold flat with a uh, electronic switch inside. I noticed here is one touch-up spot. I have to get really close to even notice it. Two feet away, you don't see it, but... I saw it up close, so I want to go ahead and point that out just to be transparent. Coming down the sides, again, I'm not noticing any kind of damage, any imperfections other than that one spot on that door. Coming across the rear, does have the park aid sensors all the way across that back bumper. A couple little spots there on that plastic piece is prepped for heavy towing. Got the sliding back glass, really, really sharp. Coming around the passenger side, again, just playing with some of these angles, trying to get you a little bit of that sunlight to play with. Not noticing any imperfections from the rear. And then coming up, I love this color. It looks almost like a black. In certain certain light, it's that really, really dark gray. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pop down on the knee, get you a good look underneath the truck. I know that was one of your big questions, is where does it come from? It's a fair question. And man, she's clean. I'm not seeing anything there of any concern. Again, comes out of uh, Missouri and Tennessee, so it's not like it's been far up north and Canada or anything like that. Coming across that front bumper, I love the red tow hooks kind of matching with the badging there on the grill. Really, really sharp. Does have your proximities as well, uh, those sensors across the front. This one also has the bug shield, which kind of protects you from those rock chips and things like that that are more prone over time. Coming into the interior, I will point out this one has the two keys uh, with it. So those are lock, unlock, remote start, and then also your hatch release. I say hatch, I'm sorry, tailgate. <laughs> Hopping into the interior. Leather is in really, really good condition. Headliner's clean. Not noticing smells, odors. Has the plastic, or I'm sorry, the rubber mat there going from one side to the other. And then hopping up to the front, here's where all those features and that extra protection really adds some value. So at 48,000 miles, it's out of the bumper to bumper from the factory. That ends at 36,000, but all your electronics are protected with the warranty. So power windows, mirrors, seat settings, as well as your power locks, all fully protected. Power seats, four wheel drive, all taken care of. It is push button start. And then tons and tons of loaded options. So here you've got lane keep assist or lane departure warning. You've got park aid uh, for your alert sensors. You have heated seats, ventilated seats on both the driver and passenger side. Dual climate control. I call that his and hers. My wife and I very rarely ever uh, agree on what temperature a vehicle should be inside. It's pretty standard. <laughs> Uh, does have the charging pad and some other charging locations right there in the front. 
Um, and then, whoops, turn the radio on. Audio worked great. I also want to point out, this one has that digital camera uh, for the rear, which is really, really nice. When you hit that, look up in the mirror, you're not seeing people in the back seat. Uh, I've got four kids, man, so believe me, it's better if I don't see them in the mirror and actually see the road. This one does have Sirius XM, the My GMC app, so if you go to a GM service, do, uh, service shop for maintenance or repairs down the road, you do get points for those as well for future savings. All of your camera settings, and they've got a ton of those in there. Um, also, it's got your navigation, Wi-Fi hotspot, Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto. Those are some of the most requested features. This one's even equipped with Amazon Alexa. Dual glove boxes. Again, seats are just really, really sharp. And then we'll end it. I wish it was a sunny day, but it does have the beautiful sunroof in it too. So there is that. If there's any questions, anything I didn't get to hit on, man, just feel free to ask. I'm here to help you and I would look forward to earning your business.